we're back in the kitchen again with actress Norma Sheehan. How are you? Great. Good? Hungry. You, you'll notice this woman here from Damo and Ivor, uh, other shows such as Bridget and Eamon and Moonboy. We're going to make an absolutely delicious sausage roll dish. So I have two 11 year olds and I have one 8 year old. They're mm -hmm. all girls. They all do 15 hours, hours gymnastics a week. So I need chicken that they'll eat. They don't like big chunks of chicken, like a leg or whatever. So when I heard of this, so I was like, like something, yeah. bring it on. Absolutely. So firstly, it's just the chicken mince. So this is Manor Farm chicken mince. It's Irish product. So it is from Cavan. Cavan. Where I'm from. So yeah, look, there you go. So you're gonna you're gonna start mixing this. So you can give that a little mix there. Oh. Um, I have a little spoon. Oh, sorry. Do you want to stick my hand <laughs> so in? Use your hands in and get <laughs> mixing. Right. So we have uh, sea salt over the garlic. This just helps you to kind of crush it. I'll just show you. You see, like the the way I've crushed it so quickly. Okay. So the sea salt kind of just stops it from moving okay. all over the place. Right. It also blends it into like a paste for you. Okay. We're gonna go with a bit of onion as well. Now I like to chop them up nice and small. So this is a tip for you. So you go, so I've just sliced all along. We cut it in three like this. And then it's just about kind of That's fine nice. dice, okay? Yeah, love so it. literally in like that. Yeah. So we have half an onion in. Sausage rolls, they normally have a lot of spices and stuff in it. But I kind of wanted to keep everything fresh and vibrant and everything. So lemon zest. So you can do this, all right? So we bring the bowl up here. Yeah. So we're, we're done with the chopping. And then you just zest this. We don't want any of the white pith either. We just want the zest on the outside. Okay. So you get lovely kind of freshness from that. Trying to get natural sweetness into them. Uh, fresh yep. thyme. I've got that in the garden. Have you that in the garden? Yeah, yeah. I do. So mix. Straight in, give that another mix again. And then that's literally the mixture done, all right? That we're, we're gonna stuff it into like a sausage. So we're gonna use puff pastry. Right. So what we do is we just get this to the side. Okay. Get rid of all this. And then we're just gonna flip the board. Okay. Oh, now, sneaky. I know, I love doing that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, so literally flip it over. And the idea of this is then we, we cut straight down the middle, like this, all right? Amazing. Okay, so simple enough. So I'll just show you one. So literally pull it out from yourself. I've never heard of chicken mince before. Have you not? No. So it's, I've never heard of yeah, it's, it's, it's very new. It's literally only out now a year in Ireland. You just kind of line it up. But a tip for you is if you wet your hands a little bit. So if you have a little bit of cold water, yeah. this really helps because even if you're making burgers or anything like that, because uh, you know when burger mixes can be quite sticky, whatever. If you yeah. wet your hands, yeah. it stops it from sticking to you. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look after number one. Yeah. <laughs> now, so we, we start here with the pastry. So we kind of just roll it over itself. So when you get to this stage here, yeah. you get your egg wash. So a little bit of egg wash here. Is that just yolk? Uh, no, it's, it's a full egg beaten. Full egg okay? beaten, right. One egg and then just like that. So you're kind of rolling it over itself. And you're just trying to get a nice shape on it. So just pull it off the pastry there so it doesn't stick. We have a tray ready there. And then you just get your knife. And it's just about kind of cutting your portions, okay? So I normally just trim off the ends. So we do like kind of that size there. It's just me, I like to score them. See that? Nice. I know. What do you mean? Score them as in like... There you go. That's the type of score is on it. Never knew what that was called. Um, so we go straight onto the tray. Straight so on, the tray. on you go. And you can see, now if you wanted, freeze them down like that and then into a, a container. So once they're frozen, straight into so a container. Make a rake of them. Make a rake of them. Christmas, parties, lunch, breakfast. <laughs> Go okay, on with you're getting carried away now. <laughs> breakfast. Now, so we have then sesame seeds, which have a pop. Nice. Color pastry is, is the most important thing at the end. Yeah, yeah. So they go into the oven. They're in at 180 degrees. They normally take about 15, 20 minutes, and then they're done. So, <laughs> happy days. We'll do another one then anyway. Okay. Now, Norma, here we go. So then you go and then just kind of shape it out there. Shape it out. Shape it out. Yeah. Hold on. Okay. Did we go this way? And then I just get my glue in a minute now. Then you just get your glue basically, which is your egg yeah, wash. There's my brush. Yeah, that's it. After working with chicken, make sure you do wash your hands yeah. before and after. Yeah. Yeah. So the glue in, seal her up. Yeah, it's perfect. Beautiful. When do I get to score it? <laughs> Could you put different spices and stuff into this? You can, you actually, it's open. This is kind of a versatile one. Uh, you can come along and add, say, cumin, coriander seeds, ground up. Um, you can add in curry powder into it. Even, look what she's changing it at the moment. She's scoring at an angle as well. So it's kind of like different, <laughs> di different ways, and everyone has their own way of, of cooking. Is the angle it's a problem? Says, no, it's no. Per it actually looks better than mine. God damn That's it. the way they are in the, in the <laughs> So yeah, egg wash it, yeah. Lob. There you go. Need to go quick. I'll get your tray for you then. This is fun. Okay. And just fun with the sesame, or do we? Yeah. On you go here. She's not good there. I know. Like our one. Fair place, yeah. Now, in you go into the oven. 
What do you think? Wow. Mine, Good, aren't they? Mine look better than yours, but... I know, because you, you laced on the egg wash. <laughs> so yeah, mine are a little bit paler, but anyway. We have mayonnaise. Yeah. Simple little bit, it's like three tablespoons of mayonnaise. Okay. This is harissa paste, so it's a spicy kind of pepper uh, with garlic and all. It's delicious, right? So then we go with a small amount. Great, you want to try it? Okay, yep, yep. Here, go for it. And then you dip. So here, cheers, actually. Cheers. Oh, that's perfect. Mmm. Mmm. Those are delicious. Mm. Absolutely. Come here, you're an absolute gem. Thank you so much for coming on. Oh, mate, as well. Thank, thank you. you. You're brilliant. Fair play to you. No, you're brilliant. <laughs> I, don't know, I didn't do much. No, you did most of the work. Um, you. It's a very simple little recipe for you. Uh, it's full of flavour as well. And you'll find more great recipes like that one over on chicken.ie. Mm. You're going to try that one on the kids, yeah? Yeah. You're going to take my one, alright, fair enough. <laughs>